Wemwega. Welcome to Kikuyu Lessons with the Village Girl. I am Wanjiro or you can always call me the Village Girl and today we are learning proverbs. Proverbs are called the Mo in Kikuyu. So we are going to look at 10 of them and their meanings. And before we start, please make sure you subscribe to this channel and as I always say, if you like this video, please share it. The first demo we are looking at is Weterera Tikoinaina. Weterera Tikoinaina. So that literal meaning is that waiting, if you wait, you won't shake. So in English, it means that patience pays. Weterera tikoinaina. It means patience pays. The second the more we are looking at is Wosera Nikohega. Wosera Nikohega. The literal meaning is kutembea nikukwa mwirevu. That's in Swahili. What they are trying to say is that do not stay in one place. It's it's good to move. Because once you go out there, you learn a lot once you're out there. So kitembea unakuwa mwirevu. Yes. Number three, we are looking at the more that says Siamo sie tisomo. A very common the more in Kikuyu. Siamo sie tisomo. That proverb means that home affairs should be kept secret. So when they say Siamo sie tisomo, they mean that like, you know, nyamazia mambo ya nyumbani. Uzi ya seme. Number four, the, the more we are looking at number four is Seigana ne seigana. When someone says that, they mean enough is enough. Seigana ne seigana. Yani zikitosha zimetosha. So they're saying enough is enough. Number five, the, the more we are looking at is Gotire donyo etare mogoroki. So that means that there is no marketplace without a madman. And I think what they mean is that there is no place you will go and lack an insane person. It does not mean that they have to be literally insane, but I feel like everywhere kukona watu, you'll find good people and stuff, but you'll find this one person who is, well, kind of crazy. <laughs> so yeah, that's what they're saying like, Donyo de Agaga, Utire Donyo, Etare Mogoruki. Okay? Yes. Number six, the demo we are looking at is Hinya Doigana Orome. Hinya Doigana Orome. Hinya means Nguvu, strength. Orome means courage. So they are saying that strength, Haitosha Nishwina, courage. Yeah, so someone might be so strong, but they have no courage to do something. So that's why they are saying, Hinya doigana orome. So they do not confuse strength and courage. Number seven, we are talking about Egekaya nenume. Egekaya nenume. That means, Ikilia inamanisha imeumwa. Egekaya Nenume. So that means there's no smoke without fire. Number eight, we have Ihu Rereda Rekuaga Onene. Ihu Rereda Rekuaga Onene. So Ihu means pregnancy. By the way, I remember I said that when we were learning months. So Ihu is pregnancy. So they are saying that the uh, pregnancy carries the future. Which is true. And then, mutoto mnyango kwa tumbo. Maybe you wanna badilish a future. The demo we are learning at number nine is kana kagare gakunyaga tayo. Kana kagare gakunyaga tayo. That means mutoto wa leopard. You remember we said ngare is leopard. Ana fanyanga tu ana chuna ngatu kama baba yake. So that means like father, like son. Kana kagare gakunyaga tayo. Like father, like son. And finally, at number 10, we have kanua wereire. Kanua wereire. Which means 
your words betrayed you your words betrayed you where it means ulijikula you ate yourself <laughs> So kanwa were yeah? of course we are talking about words so we are saying your words betrayed you and that is it for this video thank you so much for watching remember to subscribe to this channel and of course if you liked this video it's okay to share with your friends my name is Wanjiro and tiwawega <laughs>